<laughs> are these are these some Walmart.com scam returns? You think? <laughs> we got aluminum foil. <laughs> oh, there's nothing. nothing in it. They literally just bought us some aluminum foil, put it into a package, and sent back to Walmart. Back in July of last year, we ended up purchasing a whole bunch of Walmart return packages from a company. And we, uh, there was two large boxes that came in. We forgot about one of them. <laughs> well, it kind of got buried well, got in a buried. corner. Got buried. And we just kept stacking boxes on top of it. And then we we're like, what's that box? And I was like, oh, that's, that's that, uh, is that a hair? That's your beard hair. That's the beard hair. And so, on, actually we'll make sure and put a link to the, the video from like last July where we did the first huge box full of return, like unopened packages that were sent back to the Walmart hub. Um, and then it goes back to like the makers of the products and you can watch the video. So this was like the second box from that liquidation that we purchased mystery stuff in here i don't yeah, i don't weird. i don't remember what was even in the first video I, that was like six months ago yeah. i do not remember if it was good stuff or not i don't think it was i don't think it was either i don't remember <laughs> i do not remember i know it was we're doing full. a fabulous job at buying <laughs> product that is junk. Just junk i mean we're doing great if if anybody wanted to give us a review on how <laughs> well, we are doing buying junk product. I mean, we'd knock it out of the park. Heck yes, we would. Oh yeah, these, the, the people's home addresses are not removed or burned off, so we gotta be careful. We don't show people's addresses. These are big boxes, or at least on oh, top. Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of little ones on the top, bottom. On top we have some big boxes. We gotta be careful not to show addresses. There's a whole bunch. There's a Walmart package. You know, like, like it's pretty full of packages. It's a lot of packages. Walmart package. There's a why bunch in here. Yeah. Why don't we Let's just set like it down. do yeah. maybe ten in this video and then ten in another? And because yes. this is going to take us a while. This thing is super light. Whatever's in this box. Yeah, just, we'll, just be, we'll, 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 we'll try to be very careful not to show the people's home addresses on camera because nothing's burnt off. This thing's pretty light, too. Can I, um... Can I? Yeah. So, actually, we'll do two boxes first. So, let's see what people were buying off of Amazon. No, Walmart. That, oh, yeah. Walmart, not Amazon. Walmart, they sent back in a chunky, mild sauce, 16-ounce package. Oh boy, we have a hat. Oh, they bought a Walmart hat. You guess they didn't like the Walmart hat? Or is it coming apart? No, it's not coming apart. Well, I mean, it needs reshape, but we have a hat. Six tier macaron tower display stand. What's a macaron? Still factory sealed. I don't know. A macaron tower. I know what a macaroon is, yeah. but I don't know but what a macaron is. I've got one package here. This is actual Walmart, for, just... for actual Walmart return, like mail or a poly bag. This you says you got a FedEx Walmart MP, MP returns. MP returns. Walmart MP returns. Majorly practical returns, may maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Oh, we got some jeans that somebody didn't want. Or shorts somebody didn't want from Walmart. <laughs> yep, that's what that is. Yep. <laughs> yeah, that's what that is. I don't know, it has two tubes. And that's all I know. We got some holy jeans. Size medium, women's or girls or something. Size medium. Wait, this is just gonna go in the garbage. No, I was gonna keep that. Does it say on this what it is? Some holy jeans. No. Jean shorts. 
some some uh, jorts. You know what jean shorts are? Are not called jorts. No, I did not know that. Jorts. So this all must be from like their dot com site. Oh yeah, this is all from the dot com. This is not stuff that like you can buy in the store. No. It seems like. Let's see what was purchased. Yeah, I have no idea remember what came out at first video. We didn't buy any Walmart stuff again, so maybe that was a clue. Maybe why we didn't buy anything else. Uh -huh. Oh, we had like a, a box? box? Wow, that's a lot of packing material. Just, hopefully it's like jewelry or something. This is like an anime character? Yeah, it's anime. This is what it looks like. I'm assuming <laughs> it's supposed to go in a wow. stand or something. They didn't send back the bracelet. They just sent back the pillow. What a shady piece of shade, shade, shade. So this was a genuine crystal, sterling silver, 18 karat gold plated bracelet. There's the Walmart UPC and everything. That's awful. Actually, the person's name and address, everything that, that pulled the scam is from Springfield, Illinois. Illinois. We, yeah. There's your address and everything. And your phone number. <laughs> Should I call her and ask her for the, the uh, bracelet back? Be like, yeah, we, uh, you owe us an 18 karat gold plated bracelet that they sold for $98. Miss Scammy Scam Scam Scammer. And she kept it. Sold for $98 bracelet. You kept it and you sent, you sent back the box. It'll come Ooh. back and get her. She doesn't wait to it. This was Charlotte, North Carolina is where it was going. Charlotte. Originally, yeah, this was coming back, being returned to Walmart from New Fame, New York. Oh, we have a nozzle. Oh, we have a paintbrush. Not but, but a, a roller. So you, you, is it a nozzle? Nice. I think I've had this nozzle before. Looks familiar. Nice. <laughs> All right. Trash. Nice. Okay. So first few packages were exactly home run items. Once again, we have some more Walmart poly bag. Flanders, New Jersey. This was being sent back from a lady from Janer, Janer, Janer at Louisiana. Janer at. Never heard of it. Back to Walmart. She was sending back a. Oh, it's like a like a hidden camera thing. Back to Walmart. I have a dress. It's pretty. I like it. It is in the size large. Wow, you you use that quite a bit. It's all scratched up. Even the lens is scratched up. How do you scratch it up on a hidden camera? Well, I shouldn't say hidden camera, but like a just a camera, but. It like scratched up the lens. Yeah, it's pretty scratched up. It's pretty used. You probably send it back because your screen is like scratchy looking. <laughs> nice. Okay. Whew. Walmart returns. Or I should say Walmart.com returns. Oh my heavens, there's so many. Okay, we're both going to do a yellow. Nice. Which yellow? This one. That one. This was coming back from Napa, California. Oh my gosh, this is Flanders, New Jersey again, uh -huh. but a different name. They were sending back a replacement battery for a Sony CCD and a whole bunch of numbers. That's funny because I have a replacement battery also. Nice. Looks to be brand new still. Cameron's, is yours Cameron CO? Mine is two. It's by the same person. That's, cr it's the same name. And that's where it, it was going back oh. to. Oh. It was coming back from 
You're you're looking at the return address. Oh, I gotcha. Oh, this was going or coming. The person who bought it, this Park Ridge, Napa, Illinois, California. These are actually from different people being sent back from different people. That's kind of funny. Interesting. Looks to be new though. Okay, so we got some electronic stuff. Okay. Alrighty. Walmart.com Walmart return so far. I think that's why we didn't buy any more of this stuff, I think. It's kind of like left a little bit to be desired, right? Great. Clothes. Oh, wait, wait, let me feel that. Yeah. Indicott, New York. That's City of Industry, California. Valentine's Day. Wow. Here's your flowers. Nice. You're welcome. Nice. We got some flowers. Thanks for all Valentine's Day. We don't do Valentine's Day. Look what I got you. Yes, there you go. Merry Christmas. <laughs> what is this? That's what you get. Oh, it's like a vest. That's what you get. Put it on. It's very small. Wear it in the video. Wear it. I'm wearing it. It looks nice. <laughs> it's nice quality. Mm -hmm. Oof. What is it made of? The nice material. There's like no, there's no tag at all in this. Negative. It's a size large, it says. It doesn't even say that in on the garment. It's on the bag. Wow. Yeah. I think that's why we didn't buy any more Walmart.com returns. You think? <laughs> I remember now. How many more you wanna do? Let's do, how many more is left in the box? Um. About half of what we've done. I guess we'll do like two more, one each. How's that sound? Okay. A couple more. Yeah. Then Let's, maybe like we'll try again the next video. See maybe we, we can, can get some better stuff in the next video. You can have that one. Maybe. That's a little one. I'm trying to find a small one for me. I'll this take was this one. Coming back from. I can't even tell. With so much, so many labels on it. Mine just says relabel. This actually says not delivered. They actually covered up that person's address. Looks like it was, oh. I have a watch band. Fayetteville, Arkansas, where it, it was trying to go to. This is horrible. What is this? I don't know. Is this what they sent back? <laughs> this is what they sent back. <laughs> Foil. They sent back to Walmart.com some aluminum foil. Be careful with me. You know, you never know what, what might be inside of it. Are these, are these some Walmart.com scam returns, you think? <laughs> we got aluminum foil. Oh, there's nothing. nothing in it. They literally just bought us some aluminum foil, put it into a package, and sent back to Walmart. There's some scammy people in this world. Wow. I mean, there's nothing else that's in this. Like, <laughs> was on, they put some aluminum foil and sent it back to Walmart. Wow. Who is that piece of garbage that did that? This person's name is Alexis. There's their address and everything from Fayetteville, Arkansas. First name Alexis. Fayetteville, Arkansas. Sent back some aluminum foil. I hope that this catches up to you. That's all the person sent back to Walmart. That's shady. Some aluminum <laughs> foil. That's some wow. shady We bananas. will end on that package in this video. I can't go anymore on this video. That's it. That's it. I think we paid like seven bucks a package is what we had to pay. Actually, it was like seven dollars and five cents a package shipped for like the two huge boxes of package. So. We, we, we just paid $7 for a little wad of aluminum foil. Is what we paid for that. Seems reasonable. $7 what we paid for that. Wow. And we talk about inflation in this world. Well, I wonder why things get inflated. Because people steal. Stop stealing. Stop stealing. Don't steal. Don't steal. Bad Becky. Well, I didn't steal. Bad Becky. I don't steal. Bad Becky. <laughs> I had never seen that before. Uh, they they sit back, just some a little thing of aluminum foil. 
Wow, I've never seen that. Well. It's better just to send back an empty package at that point. Just send, I know. Just send an empty package. Just have it empty. <laughs> I, what's the point of putting a piece of aluminum foil in there? Maybe so if it went through the detectors, it would detect some metal. Like there's something that was in it that was metal maybe? Maybe. Or something. I don't know. I don't know. That was odd. We'll end it on that package. All so, right. That's all I can take. We'll see you next time.